Hello guys and welcome back to WoW, it's part 30 now. Oh, wow, the Let's Play is really catching on. So yeah, as I said in the last part, I, I pretty much just finished playing the last part, recording the last part, and now playing this part. And um, as I said before, I attacked that army down there, and then I came to Hireman. But then I realised, you know, I did it the same thing again, I actually ended the part. Um, one, I needed to end the turn, so I took a gamble, I just ended the turn, and nothing happened, so here we are again, nothing's really changed, all I've really done is moved up some of my troops, um, these guys are over here, and those two units of um, Gondor Spearmen and Ithilien Rangers are now in that Denethor army. The reason why I did that is because I want to actually get some battles done, I also lost a fight over Just here. Sweating. Um, and now they're attacking that settlement there. So I'm, I'll, I'll tell you what you missed, really, in a sense. First thing I want to do first, though, is put these guys there. We can retrain these. And, oh, wow, we can get so much more men. Um, so I'm just going to recruit as much men as possible and take the men into the ship. Okay, and we're going to go off again. And I was going to bring that army down to Mordor, but I don't really need it. So I'm going to bring it... To, um, to Ambar, actually. I could just take that settlement right now, actually. Yes, yes, I could. We can go okay, no we, will, we will attack the little settlement down no here. Further. And um, Your orders. I presume Without they won't have many troops in it anyway. You so, Ships you know, with this ready. army, we can just take them out quick and fast. And then I think there's another army here, actually, or some sort of thing. What's that? Some chains and some fish. <laughs> Oh, wow. And, uh, and, okay. Right. So I'm going to take... I'm going to defend the Black Gate. That's something I've got to do this part. And I'm going to try and take this Hadrum town and then move on to this next one. So what I want to do is... Dwarven the Merciless. Slay them. Oh. I didn't build any rams or anything to attack him. Okay. Let's do that. I thought I did that. Okay, maybe next turn we'll do, we'll do that. And, um... Keep your spirits high! Some Pelagrias. We'll wait till they sp they come about. Mainly because... Yeah, I'll take them one turn. Mainly because I then want to send them out towards Gondor again. Oh, right. Okay, let's repair this. And as far as the barracks goes... One more turn! Hooray! And then if we recruit any units here, one Gondor archer unit. That's fine. And Henneth Anun. I'm actually really liking that place. Can I any build anything good? Garrison's Quarter... Some stables. Let's get some stables on the go, shall we? And as for all these places, I haven't actually looked at the construction yet. I can build a library and Baradur. Destroy. No. I can build. What will increase their. No. Oh, there we go. Barracks would do that. But I don't want to spend that much money at the moment. They may revolt against me. Order. But that's okay. Anyway, whoa, we have a general here. That's pretty cool. Did not realize that. I, I did not realize that myself. Okay, Jerthang's in deep crap. It's fine. I don't care. Any of these places, if they revolt against me, I will just take them again. Your will, my lord. And also my spy died here. Or No, he didn't. My spy died down here. Trying to infiltrate this place. But it doesn't matter anyway, right? Let's take Stuart Denethor. Oh, for the love of God. So I've got to end the turn again. This is bullshit, you know? This is fucking bullshit. Right, so I'm going to end the turn again, guys. And I'll speak to you in a second. But that allows me to do some more stuff. Okay. Documents studied. Should Isengard be given the chance to unleash their device upon the world? Yes. Okay. Let's see. I, I don't know why I said yes, but I, I was going to make things interesting. Okay, whatever. It's fine. Didn't really understand it that much, but it's okay. Leave me be. Why are you Leave here? Ugh. And they seem to be following me Is down the way. Obvious? I am your ships, right? ships ready. Um. My master despises you. Engaging the enemy fleet. Average victory. Okay, that's fine. We All I want to do is get my guys back Set here sail. and stuff like that, and then ships ready. You know, come down to attack this place. Yes, sir. Sales. Yes, my lord. Where is the city? Okay, question. it's got a general. That's fine. Hmm, so he was born in Umbar. He must be really angry at me. Look at his face. I'm so angry that you took my capital. Or not my capital, my home place. And I'm like, fuck you. 
Fuck you, man. So let's attack this place here. Well, this evil. And we're gonna... Put, this we're gonna... Wow, we're really gonna... Oh my god, that's gonna be interesting. No, I, I want another ladder. Oh, there's only a bloody general there. Okay, never mind. I'm not really gonna do anything with that anyway. There will be much honor in defeating you. There will be no honor in defeating me. I don't know if I want to waste another spy by trying to infiltrate it. Chance of success, 52%. Half and half. Oh, for fuck's sake. My lord. Yes. Your will, my lord. By your You're gonna enter that place. Okay, right, no so. Today. Well, okay, let's evil. assault this first. Get these guys out of the way. And uh, we're just gonna auto, auto resolve it. There we go. So we're going to sack the settlement because we need we the tasty, the tasty coins. Uh, we can retrain some units here, actually. What do they have that's worth it? Upgrades mail. They have a town hall. Some boyer, town guards. Eh, nothing really useful. They can get a spy here, though, which is good. Completely not at all Dunedain, so that's not good at all. Capital lost. That was their capital. Fucking hell. Okay, I can't really show you that for very long. My lord. That's really bad, actually, that they lost their capital in one fell swoop. That's both Harad and their capital gone now. Um, Mordor and Harad. We have 31 regions, another four to go, and then Mordor needs to be kicked out. And uh, as part of it, I also want to take um, the Harad out. So even if I win, I don't know, I might continue it. I don't know. It depends on how you guys really feel about it. Right, let's put these guys in here. We don't need them for another turn. Okay, let's do this. Wow, what the hell? We have to attack these two units here with um, this army. Fuck. No, that's not good. They've got some troll catapults. That's what's really annoying me. And we only have three archery units. No, five, sorry. But we've got... No, we've got uh, one cavalry unit. Two cavalry units. We can do this. I will see you guys on the battlefield where I'm going to try and mop these guys up as fast as I can. Whoa! Ah, attempt a night attack. Okay, let's do that then. We can just ambush him. Okay, cool. Right, I'll see you guys. No, wait. There we go. I will see you guys on the battlefield. Okay, so I'm back. Let's uh, not wait. Let's wait another turn. Okay. Let's wait one more time. Okay, well, whatever. Um, all I really want to do is destroy them. I'm keeping my, my like senior guys well behind. So you guys can sit here. And then my infantry can sit... Oh, no, even. Sorry. No. You guys can sit up front. You got your missiles. Apart from this... Apart from this... No. 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 Okay, you get out. You guys can sit here. And group them together. And then we've got our... No, we've got Denethor who sits with our units there. So he can pop into there. And then we've got some cavalry units. Yeah, man. We can group them together. Oh, we've got two of them. Shit. Sweet, we got three cavalry units. But I'm not going to try and use them as much. I'm going to try and... Kill the, the Nazgul. I want to move... Denethor's men out. Run, men, run. I'm just gonna fire fire my uh, catapult. Oh my god. Oh no. See if one of them hit. Oh, they did. Sweet. Like, oh wow. Fuck. We could kill the Witch King or what? Oh, I keep calling him the Witch King. He's a fucking general. Okay. Pikes on. Pikes on. Okay, right, let's get these guys ready to go around. Okay, let's uh, not destroy our men. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, and uh, let's get our archers to stop. Got our men into there. Is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. 
Okay, so we're sending our men around. The cavalry's coming into them. 29. Okay, right. Let's send these guys out. Put them on save skirmish mode. This guy can sit here and fight them. The battle is evenly matched. That's bullshit. Just look at that, man. Look at how, how the Nazgul flaunt us like that. Let's go. How they managed to take so many hits and, you know, just survive. And the thing is, they just don't die either, which is really annoying. That's why I wanted to fight the Nazgul by himself. Okay, so we just lead our guys through them. Holy crap. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Okay, well, what are you guys doing? Why are they running away from us? Where's Denethor? Come on! Alright, some of them are still stuck in there. I'm just gonna speed up this battle because it's a really long and winded battle. They've lost 66% of their men. 14 cavalry left. And it still says that they're gonna win. I'm sending my general out before he dies. I know he'll die. See, that's the problem. They're fighting our king. Or our um, steward, even. But he's our emperor, in a way. He, he's the ruler of Gondor. So the Nazgul regiment's dying, 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 dying. The battle is very much mm, in our favor. Dying, dying, Literally dying. He's almost there. Two guys left. We're not dying at all anymore. We lost 6% of our men. It's terrible, man. Why are you running away from us? Okay, come on. No, 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 no. Stop throwing your... Come on, kill him. Kill him. Kill him. I wish we could have hit more of them with the um, catapult. Killed five of them. Which is nay bad, which is nay bad. Hey, hey! And. Um. Okay, run away, guys. He can kill you. I can't believe how outrageous this guy is. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Fire upon him! Rain arrows upon the Nazgul man! Kill him, come on! And swear to God. Okay. Come on, fire! Oh, the Nazgul's last charge! Oh, come on! Oh, dear Lord. Well, he's not gonna do much. He's one guy. Bet yeah, now that I said that, he's gonna come and like destroy my captain. If we continue like this, we will smash the engine. Come on, he's one dude! He's one dude. Come on. My good lord. He will not fucking die! This is horrendous. This is a clear victory. We lost 81. <laughs> Basically, every one uh, Nazgul that we killed, they killed two. Or meaning, their general probably killed like 50 of those men. But anyway, it was a clear victory. I will see you guys back on the campaign map. Okay, so we destroyed him. My lord. Very well. Um, it was kind of annoying though, having to lose all that men. All that 81 men. You can tell I hate losing men by now. Oh wow, we can send our men through. Okay, cool. Um, you can As go... I want to send the guys to Baradur. And then I can meet up with all the units later and get them ready. I sh yeah, because I'm going to send Boromir away. I'm going to send Boromir away. And when he's sent away, 
I want him to have the like some pretty good troops. Not the best troops, but some good troops. We have some units here. As you wish. So I'm gonna send them over here. If we attack Condor? No, we can't. Okay, I keep forgetting. I'm not gonna attack any more Harad settlements until until I fight off that orc army. That's why I'm just trying to delay. Um, I may have to end this part quite early though, because I have to go soon. So I'm kind of rushed for time. And I know I didn't really do much in this part. Like the battle in it was actually quite pathetic. It was just one battle against the general. But I'm guessing these uh, little updates have to happen anyway. Uh, see now. We can attack Durthang, or is it Captain Yagaz? I'm gonna stick you. Only thing he has that are probably a potential threat are probably these troll catapults and these dismounted Black Numorians. But the thing is, we have our own catapults, so we can fire upon him. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna send this unit to Baradur and hold it down. There we go, it's happy again! Yay! And this we can put to normal attacks, because I don't care if they're angry, because. I can just capture it again. As you can see here, we've got like no proper Gondor troops. But I don't think I've lost any Gondor units left. They're all just very weak. Like this Phantom Guard has been with me from the start. And yeah, it's lasted a long time. We have two Fountain Guards, don't we? No, we only have one. See, I want to get some more Fountain Guards, but I, I, you know, I'll have to raise the barracks up. Uh, I do like that music. The music's really good. It's the uh, Rohan music. As far as my knowledge concerns me, or the Rohan theme. So yes, we're doing well here, and we're almost there. Ships ready. Two turns, and we can take Vatavia. And as far as factions go, we can control 31. So we've lost 11 battles that are auto resolved ones, etc., etc. Ones that I couldn't win. Battles one was 87, and cities 20. Diplomacy wise, we've only got three enemies, which is really good to be honest. I would rather not have that many um, enemies. I think we've got like one of the least amounts apart from these uh, guys who aren't really fighting many people at all. And as far as the faction ranks going, okay, so against all factions, Mordor have plummeted and we have r like risen above them in overall rank. And Financial ranking, faction ranking. I think Mordor are below us now. Or that's the military ranking. Sorry, their military has gone downhill. So it's at the same as ours at the moment. So that means there's another army somewhere around, which is kind of annoying. In terms of faction ranking, <laughs> we're doing really well. Um, or not financial. Uh, production ranking, territorial ranking, financial. Who is that? Who the hell is... Oh! Wild Men of the Dunland have a lot of cash. Fucking hell. And the population ranking. We're, we're doing really good. So Mordor have crashed and burned. And we're almost, we're almost there. But anyway... I've got to go soon. So I can't do this battle. I want to do this battle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop that over there. So you can see what's going to happen. No difference if we attack at night or not. We're gonna sandwich them in from two sides. Two thousand men of us. Oh uh, yeah, no, just almost two thousand men. We're on par with Captain Yagaz, so our army strength is actually a little bit more, and we've got two ten-star generals. Anyway, guys, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I will be back to bring you another part soon. And then eventually, uh, in another couple of parts, we'll take Mordor probably. So anyway, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching.